verse 11 to 12. I know the plans I have for you, says the Lord. They are plans for good and not for disaster, to give you a future and a hope. In those days when you pray, I will listen. The three, verse five. Trust in the word of all your hearts, and do not lean on your own understanding. Amen. Isaiah forty-three, one verse one to two. Um, thus says the Lord, for. For I have created you, Jacob, for I have formed you, Isaac, for I have redeemed you and summoned you by your name. Verse 2, when you go through the waters, I will be with you. When you go through the rivers, they will not sweep you. And when you go through the fire, they will not break you, and they will not set you far. They will not set you ablaze. Amen. Amen. Second Timothy chapter 3, verse 16 to 17. All scripture is profitable for God for all scripture is profitable for training, for reproof, for correction, and for training in righteousness, that the man of God may be that the man of God may be e complete, equipped for every good work. Amen. Job chapter twenty three, verse twenty one to twenty five. Submit to God and you will have peace. Then things will go well for you. Listen to his instructions and store them in your heart. If you return to the Almighty, you will be restored, so clean up your life. If you give your lust for money and throw your precious gold into the river, the Almighty himself will be a treasure. He will be a precious silver. Amen. 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 God is faithful. He is reliable, trustworthy, true to his word and his promises. God is omnipresent. He is everywhere all the time. Amen. God is omnipotent. He is almighty and infinite in power. God is good. He is morally excellent and virtuous. Amen. Amen. God is good. He is God is glory. He is full of glory. Amen. God is the Alpha and the Omega. He is the beginning and the end. God is on mission. He knows everything. God is holy. He is sinless, perfect, and set apart. God is almighty. He has absolute power. Thank you. 